Mindy Ray Llewellyn died at Vanderbilt Hospital after hanging herself in a holding cell at the Cheatham County Courthouse. Fox 17's Erica Schaefer live now outside the courthouse in Ashland City to explain why Llewellyn was there and what her close friends are saying about this. Obviously, everyone is shaken in that community, Erica. Absolutely, Stacy. Mindy was held while waiting for youth services because she was listed as an endangered runaway on May 7th. Friends say her death comes as a shock because she never showed any signs of wanting to take her own life. Adam Kelly says he still can't believe his best friend is gone and how she left is even harder to grasp. I wouldn't expect anything like that from her. It makes me want to go back to try to to try to help her. TBI says 16-year-old Mindy Llewellyn tried to hang herself in a holding cell in the Cheatham County Courthouse while waiting for youth services to arrive. Officials would not say how long Mindy had been in the cell, and the Cheatham County Sheriff's Department refused to comment. Mindy was flown to Vanderbilt Hospital, where she was pronounced dead. Friends set up a memorial outside of Harpeth High School, where Mindy was a junior, and have left countless messages, pictures, and videos on her wall to keep her memory alive. And saw everything on Facebook and I just went in my room and cried. But also on Facebook, speculation that Mindy's suicide was due to bullying at school. Superintendent Tim Webb says they've looked into the claims but found no evidence proving she was bullied. Webb says this is a heartbreaking incident for everyone in Cheatham County. We've actually lost in Cheatham County schools within the last year, we've lost nine students. Um, and and it's, been, it's, it's just, it's absolutely horrible. Uh, it, you know, it keeps you awake at night trying to figure out what did we do to something? Is there something we could have done differently? Adam Kelly also says he never saw Mindy bullied. Oh, everybody loved Mindy. I never met one person that did not like Mindy. She was just a great person to everybody. The school says they will continue to keep extra counselors at the school until the end of the week. And the TBI says that this is still an ongoing investigation, even as late as this evening. Funeral arrangements for Mindy have not yet been made. Reporting live in Cheatham County, Erica Schaefer, Fox 17 News. Any rumor of bullying is a touchy subject here in the mid-state. This school year, four teenagers have taken their own lives due to bullying, one in Cheatham County. Jacob Rogers, seen here, killed himself in December after being harassed about his sexual orientation at Central High. Miranda Campbell and Philip Parker were two other teens who committed suicide due to bullying. If you know a teen who is suffering or if you need help yourself, we put up several links at fox17.com. A group of music artists is coming together to raise awareness about bullying. It's a national problem. It's certainly struck a chord here in the Mid-State. Grammy nominee and Dove Award winner Jennifer Knapp is headlining a show downtown at 3rd and Lindsley on Monday. That event starts at 6 o'clock and tickets are $20.